सदाशिवसमारंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमा शिवाचार्य पर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा श्रुतिस्मृतिपुराण आलय करुणाल नमा भगवत्द शंकर 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 शंकराचार्य केशव बादरायण सूत्रभाष्यकृत वंदे भगवत पुनः पुनः ईश्वरो गुरुरात्मी मूर्तिभेद विभागिने व्योम व्याप्तहाय दक्षिणाूर्त नम ओं सहना सहनौ घुन सह वीर कर्वाह तेजस्वीनावती तमस्तमा विदिषा वह ओं शांत शांत शांति संसिध्यांतर्जित आनंद घनमापूर्ण आत्मज्योतिरुपासमे यो ब्रह्मादेश तगुम हृदय आत्मबुद्धि प्रकाश मुक्षुर वै शरणम प्रपद्ये ओं शांत शांत शांति In the the last sutra, we are looking at the refutation of the Vaisheshikas, Tarkikas, where the Vaisheshika says that the Paramanus are the cause of the universe. And the last sutra we saw is Samavai Abhyogama Acha Samyad Anavasthite Hai. There will be Anavasthiti or Anavastha Dosha, an infinite regress. If at all Samavaya is accepted. as it is accepted in your granthas if samavaya is there between bhinna atyanta bhinna padarthas then samavaya and samavayi are also atyanta bhinna therefore there would be samavaya sambandha between them and if there is a uh, samavaya between them and samavaya and samavayi will have to have another samavaya and that samavaya also will be अत्यंत भिन्न फ्रॉम दी अर्लियर समवाय विच विल बिकम समवाई एंड देन दैट विल ऑल्सो हैव टू हैव अनदर समवाय बींग अत्यंत भिन्न एंड सो ऑन देर बी इन्फिनिट रिग्रेस अभी चर्दर वॉट नित्यम च भावात नित्यम च भावात सो दी सूत्र सेज दैट नित्यम नित्यम च भावात मीन्स दिस क्रिएटिव साइकल दैट यू आर टॉकिंग अबाउट at the end of the kalpa the parmanus are holding their visheshas and then once the creation starts this parmanus rather when the parmanus start to come together the particular types of parmanus come together to form dhanukas and then this dhanukas come together to form trinukas there is srishti so now if at all there is pravrutti of this parmanus to come together and form a dhanuka if it is on its own this pravrutti being inherent in the parmanus what would happen is that nityam eva pralaya srushtir va parmanu nam nirutti swabhavat pravrutti swabhavat va bhavati so nityam the srushti or pralaya boat would be nitya if the parmanus are coming together due to their own pravrutti and then they are going away also due to their own swabhava what will happen is that either there will be nitya srushti or there will be nitya pralaya so parmanu nam pravrutti swabhavatve pravrutte he nityame bhavat pralaya abhav prasang pralaya will never take place because parmanus by their very nature come together so that is the pravrutti swabhava if they have pravrutti swabhava then srushti will be continuous then when will pralaya take place it will never take place we have seen this dosha in sankhya paksha also being pointed out if at all the karana whichever karana it is by swabhava if it is going to by on its very own if it is going to come together or separate whatever parts they are then there will be either nitya srushti or nitya pralaya so pralaya abhav prasanga nitya srushti will take place then nivrutti swabhavatve parmanu nam if parmanus have nivrutti as their swabhava then they'll always keep on uh, they'll always remain separate they'll not come together 
so if they are conjoined earlier then they'll keep on falling apart and then by swabhava they'll keep on separating if they do that then there will be nitya pralaya so nivrutti swabhavatve parmanu nam nivrutte he nityam eva sattvat bhavati sattvat since there is continuous presence of this swabhava which will always be there that's what is swabhava swabhava is that which does not change so nityam eva sattvat srushti abhav prasanga So, Srishti will not take place, there will be Nitya Pralaya. Itham Paramanu Nam Karanatvam Nirakrutya Niravayavatvadikam Nirakartum Aha Now the Vaisheshikas claim that their Paramanus cannot have any parts. Just like the Sankhyas have claimed that Pradhana does not have parts, Sattva Rajas Tamas are Gunas which are not parts, they are the Svabhava of Pradhana. Similarly, Vaisheshikas claim that Paramanus are indivisible, they are without parts. Further, they have Vaishesha, meaning Visheshas also. They are Vaisheshikas because they say the Paramanus are Visheshas, they are holding Visheshas and we have seen in the last part that is the reason that Paramanus remain uh, remain identifiable in the sense that they can identify themselves to the other Paramanus of the same class and then come together. Only those kind of uh, Paramanus will, which will come together which can make a particular Karya. So one Karya's Paramanus will not intermix with the other Karya's Paramanus. So there will never be a confusion of that sort as to which Paramanus should be put together and nor can any Paramanus be put together with any other to bring about any karya. Specific karya can come out only by those specific uh, parmanus which hold the visheshas of that karya. So only jala parmanus can come together to form jala. You cannot have jala and prithvi mix up, parmanus mix up. So this is their prakriya. Itham parmanu nam karanatvam nirakrutya. Now this karana Karanatva being there for Parmanu, meaning Parmanu being Jagat Karana has been refuted. Having refuted that this very idea of the Parmanus being Niravayava, Niravayava means partless, without parts, and such ideas which are there, Kalpita in the Vaisheshika Darshana, that is being refuted. To refute that, the next sutra comes up, Niravayatvadikam Nirakartum, to refute that, Aha. The Sutra Kara says, Rupa di Matwa Chaviper Yayo Darshanat. Rupa di Matwa Chaviper Yayo Darshanat. So, Darshanat, it has been seen. Loki, in the world, it has been seen. What has been seen? Viper Yayaha. Viper Yayaha means something opposite to what they are claiming. What are they claiming? Rupa di Matwa. The Paramanus have Rupa. Because without having Rupa, you cannot have similar kinds of Paramanus coming together. So they retain some Rupa. So these Gunas are there. Basically why only Rupa? All these Gunas which are there in the Karya, they are there in the Karana. They are there in the Karana because Karana Guna is Karana for the Karya Guna. Yeah, elsewhere we have seen Samavai, Asamavai Karana. So Asamavai Karana is there. The, the Tantu Rupa is Karana for the, not for the Pata, but for the Pata Rupa, Tantu Rupa is Karana. Asamavai Karana. Therefore, the Paramanus also will have Rupa. And Rupa is just an example. Adi Padina, all other Gunas which are there in the Karya, they are held in the Paramanus also. This guna further becomes the guna in the dhanuka, then further in the trenuka and so on till the end karya. So rupa di matvat, if rupa etc are there, now take the examples of all the mahabhutas also, the pancha mahabhutas that the Vedanta talks about. These mahabhutas akashadi prithvyanta they have their own gunas and it is not that one Mahabhuta has one guna. 
मीनिंग आकाश है शब्द अदर्स हैव मल्टीपल गुणास रूपा इज देर आकाश डज नॉट हैव रूप वायु डज नॉट हैव रूप बट वायु है स्पर्श इन एडिशन टू शब्द सो वायु हैज टू गुणास नाउ दिस विल ऑल्सो कम अप दिस विल ऑल्सो कम अप इन दी नेक्स्ट सूत्र बट जस्ट एन आइडिया हैज टू गुणास आर देर एंड गुणा इज नॉट वन there are multiple gunas in parmanus so keeping that in mind the next two uh, that's why kinch in the next sutra kinch more over will come up as to multiple gunas also are there so if you consider even some gunas or one guna in parmanu then what will happen whatever has guna in the loka has been seen to be with parts never is a partless having guna the very idea that rupa the gunas are there in any padartha that padartha will become savayava not niravayava because this is what we have we have seen in the loka loke darshanat so parmanu nam rupaadi matvaachcha niravayavatva nityatva ityadi which gunas you are talking about niravayavatva is partless being partless and nityatva also you say that nityatva because only those which parts can have wear and tear or whatever uh, depletion of the gunas uh, of the of the angas and thereby there will be nasha so since the parmanus do not have parts they can be claimed to be nitya but now if at all niravayatva will not stand scrutiny then how will nityatva stand scrutiny therefore parmanu nam rupaadi matvat that itself becomes hetu which is their siddhanta darshana antargata prakriya antargata uh, claim so that claim that they are making that parmanus have rupa that itself rupa ityadi gunas that itself will take away niravayatva and thereby nityatva so parmanu nam rupaadi matvat cha niravayatva nityatve ityadi bhya and anuttva also anuttva will also go away because guna being there how will it be anu how can anu have guna as soon as it has guna then some size will increase because we have seen anywhere wherever guna is there that guna being there itself uh, meaning we have not seen anything anu anu is which is inferred at atoms are inferred but what have you really seen or felt or have pratyaksha pramana for all that has guna and whatever has guna is pratyaksha uh, more or less what we know is that it is pratyaksha akasha is also pratyaksha in the case of siddhanti vedanti vedanti says that akasha is known through pratyaksha pramana only there is no other inference needed vayu is pratyaksha it is uh, it is not known through inference but tarkika is the only one who says rupa has to be there for pratyaksha pramana to work whether it is the organ of sparsha also but if you say it is pratyaksha then rupa should be there we have seen this in tarka sangra and it ikas so this rupaadi matvam will make it pratyaksha as per their own siddhanta of course udhuta rupa should be there that's a different story but anyway just keep that also in mind in this refutation as to rupa parmanu nam rupaadi matva cha niravayatva anutva nityatvebhya viparyaya darshanat we have seen viparyaya what is viparyaya opposite to savayeva anutva anityatva prasajjet that is the opposite opposite to what they have in their own prakriya they say niravayava parmanus are niravayava anu and nitya but viparyaya is the resultant opposite to that savayava ananu and anitya this is the prasajjeta this is what will be the corollary or the conclusion of that analysis why loke tatha darshanat since we have seen in the loka we don't need any other pramana your tarka is based on pratyaksha so avas is also based on pratyaksha as to you will land on viparyaya not your prakriya
ಪ್ರಕ್ರಿಯೆಯ ಅಪೋಸಿಟ್ ಟು ದಿ ಪ್ರಕ್ರಿಯ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಯು ಲ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಆನ್ ವೈಶೇಷಿಕ ಮತೆ ಜಗತ್ಕಾರಣ ಪರಮಾಣುನ ರೂಪಾದಿ ಮತ್ವಾತ್ ನಿರವಯವತ್ವ ಅಣುತ್ವ ನಿತ್ಯತ್ವ ವಿಪರ್ಯ ಸಾವಯತ್ವಾದಿ ಪ್ರಸಜ್ಜೇತ ಸೊ ವೈಶೇಷಿಕ ಮತೆ ಇಂದಿ ವೈಶೇಷಿಕ ದರ್ಶನ ಪ್ರಕ್ರಿಯ ಜಗತ್ಕಾರಣ ಆರ್ ಪರಮಾಣು ಸೊ ಜಗತ್ಕಾರಣ ಪರಮಾಣು ನಾಮ ರೂಪಾದಿ ಮತ್ವಂ ಈಸ್ ಕ್ಲೀಮ್ಡ್ ರೂಪ ರೂಪ ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ರೂಪಾದಿ ಮತ್ವಾತ್ ದಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿಕಮ್ ಹೇತು ಫಾರ್ ವಾಟ್ ನಿರವಯತ್ವ ಅಣುತ್ವ ನಿತ್ಯತ್ವ ವಿಪರ್ಯ ಪಂಚಮಿ ತತ್ಪುರುಷ ಸೊ ನಿರವಯತ್ವ ಅಣುತ್ವ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ನಿತ್ಯತ್ವ ಆರ್ ಇನ್ ಇತರೇತರ ದ್ವಂದ್ವ ತೇಭ್ಯ ವಿಪರ್ಯ ದೇರ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಅಪೋಸಿಟ್ ಫ್ರಾಮ್ ದಟ್ ಕಂಪೇರ್ ಟು ದೋಸ್ ದೇರ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಅಪೋಸಿಟ್ ಕನ್ಕ್ಲೂಷನ್ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಎನಲೈಸ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸಾವಯತ್ವಾದಿ ಸೊ ಸಾವಯತ್ವ ಆದಿ ಪದೇನ ಅನಣುತ್ವ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅನಿತ್ಯತ್ವ ಸೊ ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಅರ್ಲಿಯರ್ ಥ್ರೀ ಲಿಸ್ಟೆಡ್ ಕ್ಲೇಮ್ಸ್ ವಿಲ್ ಗೋ ಫಾರ್ ಅ ಟಾಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಅಪೋಸಿಟ್ ಸಾವಯತ್ವಾದಿ ಪ್ರಸಜ್ಜೇತ ಲೋಕೆ ರೂಪಾದಿ ಮತ ಪಟಾದೇಹೆ ತಥಾ ದರ್ಶನ ಇತ್ಯರ್ಥ ಯಥಾ ಪಟ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಿ ತರ್ಕ ಯೂಸ್ ಸೇಯಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಯತ್ರ ಯತ್ರ ರೂಪಾದಿ ಮತ್ವ ತತ್ರ ತತ್ರ ಸಾವಯತ್ವಾದಿ ಸೇಸ್ ದಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತಿ ಟು ದಿ ವೈಶೇಷಿಕ ಹೌ ಯಥ ಪಟಾದೇಹೆ ಯಥ ಯಥ ಪಟಾದಿ ಸೊ ಯತ್ರ ಯತ್ರ ರೂಪಾದಿ ಮತ್ತು ಡಸ್ ಪಟ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ರೂಪ ಎಸ್ ರೂಪಾದಿ ಗುಣಾಜಾರ್ ದೇನ್ ಪಟ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಕ್ಲಾತ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಈಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಸಾವಯತ್ವ ಈಸ್ ಪಟ ಮೇಡ್ ಅಪ್ ಆಫ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಎಸ್ ಯು ಕೆನ್ ಟೇರ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಪಟ ಥ್ರೆಡ್ಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಬಿ ಸೆಪರೇಟೆಡ್ ಔಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ಸಾವಯತ್ವ ದೇ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಕಮ್ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ವಿತ್ ದಿ ತಂತೂಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಕಮ್ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಟು ಮೇಕ್ ದಿ ಪಟ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಸಾವಯತ್ವ ಮೀನ್ ಪಟ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಅಣುತ್ವ ಡೆಫಿನೆಟ್ಲಿ ಅಣುತ್ವ ಇಸ್ ಲ್ಯಾಕಿಂಗ್ ಪಟ ದಿ ಕ್ಲಾತ್ ಈಸ್ ಅನಣು ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಡೆಫಿನೆಟ್ಲಿ ಕ್ಲಾತ್ ಈಸ್ ಅನಿತ್ಯ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ಸಾವಯತ್ವ ಅನಣುತ್ವ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅನಿತ್ಯತ್ವ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ ಪಟ ಯಥ ತಥ ವೇರ್ ಎವರ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ರೂಪಾದಿ ಮತ್ವ ದೇರ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಸಾವಯತ್ವಾದಿ ಆಸ್ ಅ ರಿಸಲ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಸೊ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ಲಿ ವೈಶೇಷಿಕ ಮತೆ ಜಗತ್ಕಾರಣ ಪರಮಾಣು ನ ಸಾವಯತ್ವಾದಿ ಪ್ರಸಜ್ಜೇತ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ರಿಫ್ಯೂಟೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ನಾಟ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಕಾರಣತ್ವ ಆಫ್ ವೈಶೇಷಿಕ ಪರಮಾಣು ಬಟ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ದೇರ್ ಬೀಂಗ್ ನಿತ್ಯತ್ವ ಇತ್ಯಾದಿ ದಟ್ ದೇ ಕ್ಲೀಮ್ ಕಿಂಚ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಎನಿ ವೇ ಅದರ್ ದೆನ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ನಥಿಂಗ್ ಇಸ್ ನಿತ್ಯ ಇವನ್ ಮಾಯಾ ಇಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಆಪೇಕ್ಷಿಕ ನಿತ್ಯತ್ವ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ರಿಯಲ್ ನಿತ್ಯತ್ವ ರಿಯಲ್ ನಿತ್ಯತ್ವ ಇಸ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಫಾರ್ ಪರಮಾರ್ಥ ಪದಾರ್ಥ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಪರಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಉಭಯತ ಚ ದೋಷಾತ್ ಉಭಯತ ಚ ದೋಷಾತ್ ಸೇಸ್ ದಿ ಸೂತ್ರಕಾರ ಆಸ್ ಟು ಮೋರ್ ಓವರ್ ಇಫ್ ಅಟ್ ಆಲ್ ಯು ಕ್ಲೇಮ್ ದಟ್ ದೀಸ್ ಗುಣಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ಇನ್ ಪರಮಾಣುಸ್ ದೆನ್ ವಿಲ್ ಆಸ್ಕ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ಯೂನಿಫಾರ್ಮ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಆಫ್ ಗುಣಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಇನ್ ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಪರಮಾಣುಸ್ ಆರ್ ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ವೇರಿಂಗ್ ಗುಣಾಸ್ ಸೊ ದಿ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ದಟ್ ಐ ವಾಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಅರ್ಲಿಯರ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ವಾಸ್ ದಿ ಪೃಥ್ವಿ ಪದಾರ್ಥ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕಂಪೇರ್ ದಟ್ ಟು ಆಕಾಶ ಆಕಾಶ ಪದಾರ್ಥ ಸೊ ಆಕಾಶ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಶಬ್ದ ಆಸ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಗುಣ ವಾಯು ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಶಬ್ದ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸ್ಪರ್ಶ ಅಗ್ನಿ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಶಬ್ದ ಸ್ಪರ್ಶ ರೂಪ ದೆನ್ ಜಲ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಶಬ್ದ ಸ್ಪರ್ಶ ರೂಪ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ರಸ ಪೃಥ್ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಫೈವ್ ಶಬ್ದ ಸ್ಪರ್ಶ ರೂಪ ರಸ ಗಂಧ ನಾವು ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಆಲ್ ದೋ ದಿ ತಾರ್ಕಿಕ ಕ್ಲೇಮ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಗಂಧವತಿ ಪೃಥ್ವಿ ಪೃಥ್ವಿ ಈಸ್ ದಟ್ ವಿಚ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಂಧ ಈಸ್ ದಿ ಲಕ್ಷಣ that the vaisheshika
so now either you say that there are only standard set of gunas in in a particular parmanu uh, in all the parmanus you make a claim that parmanus have guna now you either agree that there are uniform number of gunas in all parmanus or you claim that there are varying number of gunas in various parmanus which is your claim whichever paksha you take it is ubhaya pasha rajju because ubhayata cha doshat if you say that there is there is nyunatvam meaning in akasha there is one shab one shabda guna and in prithvi there there are multiple gunas five gunas adhika so upachita anupachita upachita is nyuna less anupachita is adhika more so if you say upachita gunas and anupachita gunas in various parmanus they differ gunas differ then also there is a dosha and if you say that there is uniformity meaning there are only one or two or whatever you say standard number of gunas then also there is a dosha so what is the exact dosha since the vritti is short if i tell it here itself then it is a repetition i would rather cover it in the sutra vritti so in both cases you will have dosha what doshas you have vaisheshikamate paramanavah kim उपचित अनुपचित गुणात्मक कल्प्यंते न वा सिद्धांति आज द क्वेश्चन टू दी वैशेषिका एज टू वेदर युअर कल्पना ऑफ बेस्ड ऑन सम आधार मे बी यू हैव सम आधार दिस कल्पना इज बेस्ड ऑन सम बेसिस आई मीन इज बेस्ड ऑन सम फाउंडेशन और सम अंडरलाइंग थॉट दैट इज फाइन बट इज स्टिल अ कल्पना इट इज ऑल एन इन्फ्लुएंस इट्स अ हाइपोथोसिस दैट यू हैव इमेजिन दैट देर समथिंग कॉल एज परमाणु so these parmanus that you imagine to be there as the jagat karana do they have gunas which are nyuna upachita anupachita or not meaning they have gunas which are varying across parmanus or they are standard uniform adye meaning if you say yes they are keep upachita anupachita gunatmaka so upachita atma here is swarupa swabhava so by swarupa they have either less or more gunas based on what is their vishesha if they are a particular padarthas uh, um, parmanus then they'll have that particular set of gunas and if they are another padarthas which have another padarthas uh, parmanus which padartha has that padartha which has less number of gunas or more number of gunas then they'll have similar number of gunas these parmanus of that particular padartha so adhi in that paksha what will happen meaning if there is a varying number of gunas across parmanus anutva vyagata there will be a dosha which is anutva vyagata they will no longer be anu why if you say that okay three gunas are there then it is anu and now the other has five gunas then whatever is up to three is anu then what has four or five gunas that will become ananu so anutva vyagata will be there you cannot have if you say that uh, there is one guna that is akasha and therefore it is not pratyaksha or whatever then as soon as it gets some other sparsha guna it will become ananu maybe it is not visible to the naked eye but still it will be anu, ananu at least that dosha you should agree with you keep on adding gunas then the size will keep on growing because you have seen that elsewhere also it is so that whatever gunas are there those gunas bring in some some particularity that particularity comes with its own size so to say so your parmanu will have more parima, parimana and then the size will increase it will no longer be anu and वाइज अणुत्वयागात उपचित अनुपचित अनुपचित गुणात्मक पृथ्वीव्यादे हे स्वरूप उपचय दर्शनात वी हैव सीन दैट एज एंड व्हेन यू कीप ऑन एडिंग गुणास स्टार्टिंग विद आकाश द साइज कीप्स ऑन ग्रोइंग द सटलिटी गोस अवे एंड इन द ग्रॉसर फॉर्म मैनिफेस्ट सो दिस इज प्रत्यक्ष इन लोक सो एज यू गो फ्रॉम आकाश टू पृथ्वी 
in each of the mahabhutas there is an increment in their size grosser form they are they are grosser from subtle to gross is the journey as the gunas keep on adding and in vedanta we say that that which has lesser gunas is is subtler the concept is also subtler therefore when brahma is said to be atma brahma atma is said to be nirguna it is extremely difficult to understand akasha itself is very difficult akasha is misconstrued as space which can be divided ghatakasha matakasha itivat or when you say that i want to buy a plot you say that what kind of a space are you looking for i am looking for 30 40 or 60 40 or whatever have you these are the demarcations made and these demarcations are of the land where there is space so the space is misconstrued to be divided which can never be divided what you are really dividing is prithvi but a prithvi being divided is not the claim you are selling space the space is being sold uh, is sold is uh, space is being advertised by saying that this is what we are selling and there is there is always a bhranti oh this is my space do not en- encroach my space all this may be you know uh, because there is no other way to converse that may be possible as to say that no this is just a mechanism this is a methodology a way to converse but the fact is still that the space is where the bhranti is that the space is being divided as the boundary is drawn between or a boundary wall comes up between the two plots of land even there in the thickness of the boundary there also there is space that space is not considered as space by many is not known to many the ghatakasha is separate from another ghatakasha but the ghata that divides is all divides the space or gives the bhranti of division of space that also has space that also takes space so space cannot be divided but there is a bhranti so what i am saying is that the subtler the concept it is difficult to understand and when is the concept subtler or when is the padartha subtler it is subtler when it has as less number of gunas what it means is that when there are more number of gunas then it is grosser and as soon as you say that there is something grosser than the other and that is also parmanu because its karana is parmanu that also has the same number of gunas then between these parmanus there is bheda of gunas there are there is a grosser parmanu now that grosser parmanu will lose its anuttva so anuttva vyaghata because upachita anupachita gunatmaka prithivyade prithvi ityadi that we see has more number of gunas and anupachita is that which has upachita upachita is nyunatva so anupachita is at the end prithvi and at the other end is upachita akasha nyuna akasha and adhika prithvi adhika guna adhika guna vati prithvi and न्यून गुणवान आकाश और आकाशम आकाशम टेक्स बोथ गुणास बोथ लिंगास सो यू सी अ रेंज वेर एज दी गुणाज इनक्रीज स्वरूप उपचय दर्शनाथ एज दी गुणा इनक्रीज दी साइज इनक्रीजेस देर इज एन इनक्रीज इन स्वरूप स्वरूप बिकम्स ग्रॉसर by swarupa the padartha becomes grosser therefore you cannot take the adya paksha as in there there are varied number of gunas in various parmanus that is a claim which is refuted then if this uh, puropakshi vaisheshika were to say that no we do a kalpana of uniform number of gunas if you make that dvitiye tatkare prithivyadishu रूपाद्यनुपलम प्रसंग इति उभयता अपि दोषात अनुपपन्न परमाणु कारणवाद इन दि सेकेंड पक्ष वेर यू से देर आर यूनिफॉर्म नंबर ऑफ मीनिंग टू कीप इट अणु अणुत्व शुड नॉट बी कॉम्प्रोमाइज देर फोर यू हैव टू कीप लेस नंबर ऑफ गुणास सो इफ यू से देर आर यूनिफॉर्म नंबर ऑफ गुणास दे आर वेरी लेस टू कीप दि परमाणु अणु एटॉमिक इन साइज देन पृथ्वी विल नॉट बी पॉसिबल वाय बिकॉज पृथ्वी हेज मोर गुणास यू कैनॉट हैव मोर गुणास इफ यू से that there are limited number of 
गुणाज विच विल नॉट इंक्रीज इन द परमाणु ऑफ द पृथ्वी देन तत्कार्य पृथ्वी आदि पृथ्वी विच हैज गंधा दैट कैन नॉट मैनिफेस्ट इन पृथ्वी व्हाई बिकॉज़ दिस परमाणु विच आर अणु इन साइज एंड यू आर प्रोटेक्टेड अनुत्तम बाय क्लेमिंग दैट देयर आर लिमिटेड यूनिफॉर्म नंबर ऑफ गुणाज देन दीस गुणाज आर कारण फॉर द कार्य गुणाज जस्ट लाइक तंतु रूप इज कारण फॉर पट गुण पट रूप तंतु रूप इज कारण फॉर पट रूप देर फोर दि कारण गुण इज कारण फॉर दि कार्य गुण नौ दिस पृथ्वी के नॉट हेव गंध इत्यादि बिकॉज युअर परमाणु पृथ्वी परमाणु डज नॉट हेव गंध बिकॉज यू सेट दैट देर आर लेस नंबर ऑफ गुण टू कीप इट अणु कीप दि परमाणु अणु सो द्वितीय तत्कार पृथ्वी रूप आदि अनुपलंब प्रसंग रूप इत्यादि रूप आदि सो रूप विल नॉट बी देर विच इज देर इन वन ऑल्सो दैट वोट बी देर इन जला रूप प्लस रसा इज देर दैट रसा ऑल्सो विल नॉट बी देर इन पृथ्वी सो रूप रसा एंड गंध विच इज देर ओनली इन पृथ्वी दैट ऑल्सो वोट बी देर सो रूप आदि अनुपलंब प्रसंग एंड You cannot say ishtapati. Let it be so. The tena kim. You cannot make such a claim because it is experience. Prithvi and your lakshana itself is what gandhavati. Prithvi gandha is a guna which Prithvi has and that is what you call as Prithvi. That padartha which has gandha as its guna is Prithvi. You cannot say that gandha is not there and rupadi guna zar definitely there in Prithvi. Iti ubheta api doshat. You take either paksha there will be. दोषा इन बोथ पक्षास देर इज अ डिफेक्ट अनुपन्न परमाणु कारण देर फॉर वॉट दोषा दोष हे तो हो बिकॉज इन ईदर पक्षा देर इज अ दोषा इन बोथ पक्षास देर इज अ दोषा देर आर डिफरेंट दोषा देर फॉर परमाणु कारण वाद इज अनुपन्न इज अंटेनेबल यू के नॉट क्लेम दैट परमाणु आर कारण फॉर दी जगत दैट हेज बीन रिफ्यूटेड अभी च फर्दर वॉट दिस हैज बीन कवर्ड हिंटेड इन दी लास्ट अधिकरण ऑफ दी प्रथम अध्याय वॉट ऑज सेड एज एज दट इज दट दी व्यासादी आचार्य और अदर आचार्य ऑल्सो नो बडी हु इज रिस्पेक्टेड इन दी दार्शनिक संप्रदाय एज इन इन पुराणाज इत्यादि ऑल्सो दे दीज ऋषि मुनीस हैव नॉट एक्सेप्टेड परमाणु कारणवाद एट ऑल ईश्वरा इज एक्सेप्टेड टू बी द क्रिएटर बाय ऑल नो बडी एक्सेप्ट दैट परमाणु इज कारण इंडिपेन्डेंटली सो अपरिग्रहाच अत्यंत अनपेक्षा अपरिग्रहात इज By Ausha also, even by Ausha, the Tarkika's philosophical aspect or philosophical parts in their darshana has not been accepted. Of course, the Tarka and the uh, dialectic methodology or discussion for discussion, uh, some gold standard has been set up by Tarkikas, which are acceptable to us for for the most part, and therefore. that is not the not the philosophical aspect meaning the tarka which is used to analyze and establish something including their own darshana that tarka is agreeable meaning we will we'll accept that across the darshanas let there be logical discussion that logic may be as brought up by a tarkika and he has Uh, they have done a good work a good job of making some standard rules most of them are acceptable because we'll also follow them we follow them in fact other darshanas also follow them vyakrana and tarka are said to be upaka upakaraka for all if you want to study anything vyakrana and tarka is needed if you want to study vyakrana also further tarka is used in vyakrana granthas also इन महाभाष्य इत्यादि देर विल बी तर्क इन एनी टीका 
ऑफ सूत्र व्याकरण सूत्र दिल भी तर्क काशिका विल ऑल्सो एनालाइज सूत्र इट सेल विथ तर्क इफ सम सूत्र व्याकरण सूत्र सेज से द पर्टिकुलर वर्ड दैट वर्ड पर्टिकुलर वाई दैट पर्टिकुलर वर्ड हैज बीन मेन्शन देर बी एनालिस दैट एनालिस इज तर्क इफ यू गो टू मीमा इन मीमा ऑल्सो देर इज तर्क यू हैव बीन सींग इन अर्थ संग्रह ऑल्सो देर इज तर्क इन टीका लेवल एट टीका लेवल डेफिनेटली देर इज तर्क वेदांत हैज तर्क ऑल ओवर इन फैक्ट वेदांत हैज तर्क एट दी टीका लेवल भगवान भाष्यकार ऑल्सो यूज इट टीका हैज अ लॉट ऑफ इट एंड देर आर वाद ग्रंथा दृहत प्रस्थान त्रया इट सेल्फ इज एंटायरली तर्क बिकॉज डिस्कशन विथ दी अदर्स हैव टू बी तर्क फॉर नास्तिक देर इज नो श्रुति एज प्रमाण वेन दी डिस्कशन इज विथ नास्तिक बौद्ध जैन चार्वाका देन भगवान भाष्यकार यूज इज तर्क प्युअर तर्क देर इज नो श्रुति एज प्रमाण देर एट ऑल If at all Shruti is shown as a pramana, that pramana of Shruti is shown to convince the astika sadaka who is also sitting there. It is not an argument made with the nastika. In the nastika uh, refutation also you see Shruti quotations, but they are made for the benefit of the astika sadakas. But the refutation is completely based in tarka. so all this tarka is agreeable to us but what you have landed upon you the vaisheshika darshan using your own tarka you have failed yourself because you are landing on something which is illogical and also calling yourself as astikas having shruti virodha in both ways you will have you will have compromise your darshana or your vada that will not stand scrutiny at all through logic also and it will not trace back to it doesn't trace back to shruti therefore either way you will not be able to establish the vada at all and therefore it is not acceptable to pramanikas who are seen in who are seen analyzing or establishing whatever shruti says in puranas and smriti granthas therefore since it is not acceptable aparigraha since the vaisheshikas tarkikas nyay vaisheshikas parmanu vada has not been accepted even in a bit even a bit even in a part in an ausha by the shishtas therefore also च अपरिग्रहात च अत्यंतम अनपेक्षा अत्यंतम अनपेक्षा अत्यंत मीनिंग अनपेक्षा मीन्स वी डोंट नीड दिस बट देन रियली इट मीन्स उपेक्षा इट शुड बी सेट असाइड बिकॉज अत्यंत इज देर इफ इट इज जस्ट सेड अनपेक्षा देन देर इज नो डिपेन्डन्सी ऑन वैशेषिक ग्रंथास और दर्शन बट अत्यंत अनपेक्षा कंप्लीटली टू बी सेट असाइड उपेक्षा इतर्थ सो परमाणु कारणवाद से कनचिद अंशन कईचिदी शिष्ट अपरिग्रहा बाय शिष्ट एनी कईचिद शिष्ट बाय एनी शिष्टाज इफ यू लुक एट दिस् परमाणु कारणवाद हेज नॉट बीन एक्सेप्टेड ओके इट हेज नॉट बीन एक्सेप्टेड completely but maybe the parts are accepted like in uh, yoga grantha when we looked at that it was said that yoga also is refuted because sankhya is refuted and yoga is practice of sankhya but there is a difference the the refutation of sankhya was refutation of of the complete philosophy of sankhyas which is totally based upon the pradhana as jagat karana and yogis accept that they don't reinvent the wheel but their darshana is not parmanu uh, the pradhana as karana of jagat they say that this is not our focus area their practice which is talked about is in ashtanga 
ಸೊ ಅಷ್ಟಾಂಗ ಯೋಗ ಈಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಪ್ರೈಮರಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಪ್ರಧಾನ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಪ್ರಧಾನ ಕಾರಣವಾದ ಬಟ್ ಪ್ರೈಮರಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಈಸ್ ಅಷ್ಟಾಂಗ ಯೋಗ ಲೀಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಸಮಾಧಿ ವೆರಿ ಲಕ್ಷಣ ಆಫ್ ಯೋಗ ಇಸ್ ಚಿತ್ತವೃತ್ತಿ ನಿರೋಧ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಸಮಾಧಿ ಸೊ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ರಿಫ್ಯೂಟೆಡ್ ಅಟ್ ಆಲ್ ಸೊ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ಲಿ ಮೇ ಬಿ ಅಂಶ ಆಫ್ ದ ವೇ ಅಂಶ ಆಫ್ ಯೋಗ ವಿಚ್ ಫಾಲೋಸ್ ದಿ ಅಂಶಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಯೋಗ ವಿಚ್ ಫಾಲೋ ದಿ ಸಾಂಖ್ಯಾಸ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ರಿಫ್ಯೂಟೆಡ್ ಬಟ್ ದಿ ಅಂಶ ಆಫ್ ಯೋಗ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಅಷ್ಟಾಂಗ ಯೋಗ ವಿಚ್ ಫೈಂಡ್ಸ್ ದಿ ಬೇಸಿಸ್ ಇನ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಯೋ ಯೋಗ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಸಾರ್ ದೇರ್ ಯೋಗ ಕುಂಡಲ್ಯ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಈಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಇನ್ ಫ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಅಷ್ಟಾಂಗಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ಲಿಸ್ಟೆಡ್ ಇನ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಒನ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ದಿ ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಅಷ್ಟಾಂಗ ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಅಂಗಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ಲಿಸ್ಟೆಡ್ ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಏಟ್ ಅಂಗಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ಲಿಸ್ಟೆಡ್ ದೆನ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅಪ್ರಮಾಣ ಸೊ ಅಂಶೇನ ಅಪ್ರಮಾಣತ್ವ ಅಂಶೇನ ಪ್ರಮಾಣತ್ವ ವೆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಟು ಯೋಗ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ದಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತಿ ವೇದಾಂತಿ ವುಡ್ ಸೇ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ಲಿ ಮೇ ಬಿ ಹಿಯರ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ದಟ್ ಶಿಷ್ಟಾಸ್ ಬೈ ಶಿಷ್ಟಾಸ್ ಪರಮಾಣು ಕಾರಣವಾದ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬೀನ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ಬಟ್ ಮೇ ಬಿ ಇನ್ ಸಮ್ ಅಂಶ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಟ್ ದಿ ಕೇಸ್ ಸೊ ದೇರ್ ದಿ ವೃತ್ತಿ ಕ್ಲಿಯರ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಕೇನಚಿದಿ ಅಂಶೇನ ಅಪರಿಗ್ರಹಾತ್ ಶಿಷ್ಟೈ ಸೊ ಕೈಶ್ಚಿದಿ ಶಿಷ್ಟೈ ಬೈ ಎನಿ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಶಿಷ್ಟಾಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬೀನ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇನ್ ಎನಿ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬೀನ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಸೆಟ್ ಅಸೈಡ್ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ಲಿ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಸೆಟ್ ಅಸೈಡ್ ದಿ ಪರಮಾಣು ಕಾರಣವಾದ ಸೊ ವೆನ್ ಎವರ್ ದಿ ಫಿಲಾಸಫಿಕಲ್ ಆಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ದಿ ಮೇಜರ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ತರ್ಕ ಗ್ರಂಥ ದಟ್ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಅಪ್ ಆರ್ ದಿ ತರ್ಕ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ವಿಚ್ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಅಪ್ ದೇರ್ ಆಸ್ ಟು ದಿ ಲಾಜಿಕ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಬೀಂಗ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟೆಡ್ ಆಲ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಯೂಸ್ ಟು ಇನ್ ದೇರ್ ದರ್ಶನ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಯೂಸ್ ಟು ಎನಲೈಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸೆಪರೇಟ್ ಔಟ್ ದಿ ಪದಾರ್ಥಾಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾಟಗರೈಸ್ ದೆಮ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಬಿಕಮ್ಸ್ ದಿ ಬೇಸಿಸ್ ಆಸ್ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಪರಮಾಣುಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ವಿಲ್ ವಿಚ್ ವಿಲ್ ಎಂಡ್ ಅಪ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಇಂಡಿವಿಜುವಲ್ ನಿತ್ಯ ಬೈ ಎನಲಿಸಿಸ್ ಆರ್ ಬೈ ಕಲ್ಪನಾ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಸೆಟ್ ಟು ಬಿ ದಿ ಜಗತ್ ಕಾರಣ ಆಲ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಅನ್ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟೇಬಲ್ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ಕೇನಾಪಿ ಅಂಶೇನ ಕೈಶ್ಚಿದಿ ಶಿಷ್ಟೈ ಅಪರಿಗ್ರಹಾತ್ ಪರಮಾಣು ಕಾರಣವಾದ ತತ್ರ ಅತ್ಯಂತ ಅನಪೇಕ್ಷ ಅನಪೇಕ್ಷ ವಾಟ್ ಕರ್ತವ್ಯ ಸೊ ಅನಪೇಕ್ಷ ಭವತಿ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಯುನೋ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಸೂತ್ರಕಾರ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಆಡ್ ಭವತಿ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ವಾಟ್ ಯುನೋ ಇಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅನಪೇಕ್ಷ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಡಿಪೆಂಡೆನ್ಸಿ ಬಟ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಬೀಂಗ್ ಸೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅತ್ಯಂತ ಅನಪೇಕ್ಷ ಕರ್ತವ್ಯ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಲೈಕ್ ವಿ ಹವ್ ಸೀನ್ ಇನ್ ದಿ ದಿ ಇನಿಷಿಯಲ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ಚತುಸ್ಸೂತ್ರಿ ವಿ ಹವ್ ಸೀನ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ ಹವ್ ಸೀನ್ ಅಥಾತ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಜಿಜ್ಞಾಸ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಎಲ್ ಅಥಾತ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಜಿಜ್ಞಾಸ ನಾಟ್ ಭವತಿ ಕರ್ತವ್ಯ ಸೊ ಕರ್ತವ್ಯ ಈಸ್ ಅ ಪದ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾತ ಅಧ್ಯರ್ತವ್ಯ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಆಡೆಡ್ ಶ್ರೀವಾರ್ಥಿ ಬಿ ಬೈ ಹೂಮ್ ಬೈ ದೋಸ್ ಹೂ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಮೋಕ್ಷ ಎಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಗೂರ್ ಸೊ ಶ್ರೇಯ ಅರ್ಥ ಯೇಷಾಂತೆ ಶ್ರೇಯೋರ್ ಶ್ರೇಯೋರ್ಥಿನ ತೈ ಶ್ರೇಯೋರ್ಥಿ ಪರಮಾಣು ಕಾರಣವಾದ ಅತ್ಯಂತ ಅನಪೇಕ್ಷಾ ಕರ್ತವ್ಯ ಯು ಶುಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಉಪೇಕ್ಷಾ ಕರ್ತವ್ಯ ಇತ್ಯರ್ಥ ಯು ಶುಡ್ ಸೆಟ್ ಎಸ್ ದ ಬೈ ದೀಸ್ ಮುಮುಕ್ಷೂಸ್ ದಿ ತಾರ್ಕಿಕ ಪರಮಾಣು ಕಾರಣವಾದ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ಲಿ ಸೆಟ್ ಅಸೈ
बौद्धास कंसा टू दैट देर इज अर इज एन इंटरेस्टिंग संगति बाय दी वृत्ति सो वॉट इज सेट इज दैट फर्स्ट वी नीड टू नो दी वैशेषिका वॉट डू दे हैव इन देर फिलोसॉफी विच हेज नॉट कम अप इन डिस्कशन सो फार but what we should know to understand the sangati i'll read the sangati first and then uh, these words are difficult to understand therefore we need to know what do vaisheshika say and how that is comparable to the bauddhas as to how the vritti says how did this adhikarana come up so em ardha vainashika vaisheshika mata nirakarana anantaram purna vainashika matam buddhistham idani nirakriyate iti avantara sangatya idamaha avantara sangati is there mean there is a secondary sangati what is the secondary sangati here evam in this manner ardha vainashika vaisheshika mata see the vaisheshika mata is considered as ardha vainashika who are the purna vainashikas purna vainashika matam is bauddha matam bauddhas are purna vainashika purna vainashika means they they say that everything is destroyed and from nothing comes up something basically shunyavadis in one way or the other shunyavadis shunyavadis themselves are a category out of the four in bauddha paksha bauddha paksha itself is divided into four we have seen this in uh, vichara sagara so the bauddhas are generally considered as shunyavadis whether they are kshanika vijnanavadis also there will be there is some level of shunyavada there also because they do not accept chaitanya between the between anything meaning between moments let it be between moments between janmas between uh, kalpas between karmas whatever they have they agree with karma but there is nothing which is continuing across karmas very strange so their claim is that anything that is born is born out of nothing for the most part it is not applicable to all buddhists but in some way or the other it will be applicable so therefore they are considered as purna vainashika their mata is considered as purna vainashika mata whose mata bauddha mata buddha uh, buddhism those who follow buddhism their mata now why are uh, these uh, vaisheshikas who are astikas compared with nastikas here so here they are called as they are not nastikas but they are saying ardha vainashika their logic leads to what nasha in half why because they say that so this is where we need to understand what vai- vaisheshikas talk about so vaisheshikas say that if the part is having wear and tear meaning rather let's say take a pot so if you take a pot the pot is having wear and tear that is for sure because the weather changes if there is humidity also it, it may affect the pot if the there is heat it may affect pot if there is uh, cold it may affect pot so everything will end up affecting the pot and what will happen what is this wear and tear wear and tear is basically the parts are withering away in one way or the other they are getting weak one part will be destroyed and then what happens when the part is destroyed which is not seen the amsha which is destroyed even if it is not seen the vaisheshika say that the pot is different the the pot continuing in time is different from the earlier pot the same pot is considered as a set of different pots across time as the time progresses because of wear and tear so what is their claim is eka avayava nasha leads to avayava vinasha and their uh, avayavi vinasha so avayava nasha leads to avayavi nasha this is their understanding so what is example they say that the the flower also if there are five petals in a flower if one petal is destroyed then is it the same flower or not so vaisheshika say that it's a different flower the 
five petal flower and the four petal flower although the same flower has lost a petal it is a different flower so now if you store water in a clay pot they'll say that this water will eat away the clay in bits minutely and therefore when you throw that water at least then the pot is different the earlier pot where you stored the water versus having stored that water for a prolonged period having the the water has washed out having stored the water for a prolonged period in the pot the the stored water has eaten away at the clay within the boundaries of the pot and therefore that pot has changed it's a different pot so it's a new pot when you heat the pot due to this agni ghata sanyoga also what will happen there is connection between atoms which is destroyed when you heat up the bonds between the parmanus of the ghata are destroyed and then some some of these anushas are going to get destroyed themselves and therefore the pot is destroyed the earlier pot is destroyed and a new pot is formed this is what the vaisheshikas think therefore they are called as ardha vainesh uh, uh, vainashikas in the vritti it is called as they are called as ardha vainashika whereas bauddhas are what they say that at each moment entire pot is changing it is not the same pot at all so they say that the chanika vijnana vadins also say that like the their example is the flame just like the flame appears to be steady in in a still weather the flame appears to be steady but is that fire the same in the flame it is not there is a different ansha of the oil burn and the fire which is burning the oil that fire is different from the earlier moment so each kshana the agni is changing and the flame is appearing to be the same because there is a similarity between the earlier unit of fire and the next unit of fire but the current unit of fire and so on like the flow of water also ganga pravahavat iti va so when you dip your hand in the flowing ganga the second time then the first time the water that you touch is different from the second time the water that you touch so every time you dip your hand in the water the water that you are touching is different but it has the appearance of same water you call it as ganga i i had a ganga water bath so that water has changed but it appears to be the same so every moment the prapancha is changing ghata is changing ghata ghata padadi prapancha is changing as per the bauddhas so therefore they are purna vainashika so prati pratikshana pratikshanam nasha bhavati iti bauddha vadanti therefore what all bauddhas are considered as purna vainashikas their mata is purna vainashika mata so now what has happened vaisheshika mata has been refuted and buddhistham idanim since in the buddhi of the siddhanti what has happened is that she has refuted vaisheshika who is known to be ardha vainashika so as soon as the ardha vainashika comes to the mind and the job is over of refuting vaisheshikas then the vaina uh, vainashika shabda is there that triggers the purna vainashika bauddha paksha and therefore that paksha is taken next that is the sangati ev ardha vainashika vaisheshika mata nirakarana antaram purna vainashika matam buddhistam it is already there in the mind bauddhas have come up in the mind let them be refuted this is the idea idanim now nirakriyate that purna vainashika matam nirakriyate now the bauddhas are being refuted this is the secondary sangati through that secondary sangati the next adhikaranam comes up iti avantara sangatya idamaha samudaya adhikaranam so samudaya adhikarana is the next adhikarana the sutra is samudaya ubhay hetu ke api tarap prapti hi samudaya ubhay hetu ke api tarap prapti hi samudaye is the padacheda samudaye ubaye hetuke api tara prapti hi tara prapti hi um, tara tara prapti hi is a single word tad is samudaya so samudaye what is being said is that samudaya so now uh, in bauddhas as i said that bauddhas are 
of four categories meaning there is matabheda in bauddhas themselves this is after buddha after buddha mostly buddha maintained silence so there are some who followed exactly whatever little he said and then made a darshan out of it there are others who added to it they interpreted what he said they interpreted perhaps the silence also and then there is lot of variation in their philosophy so thereby there are four madhyamika and then yogachara so kshanikavada otherwise uh, then uh, the shunyavada and these also categorized as what sautrantika and who uh, you know follow the sutras they follow the sutras bodhas also have their sutras so they follow sutras and there are vaibhashikas also so sautrantika vaibhashika there are uh, there is one level of division and this four with philosophical differences also there is division so what is the philosophical difference so these uh, the two among these four agree that the there is outside prapancha they don't say that the entire prapancha is shunya it is not there it is an appearance they say that there is something outside then how is that something outside come up meaning how is this prapancha come up as karya so to that they have similar ideas as the vaisheshikas that they agree that parmanus are the cause so for the samudaya to come up bahya samudaya samudaya is bahya samudaya the samudaya means a group so the group grouping of something that becomes a karya outside as prapancha jagat that grouping is of parmanu so parmanu hetu so ubay hetu ke means considering jagat karana to be either ubhaya both whether it is parmanus or skanda skanda is for those other two categories of philosophers buddhist philosophers who say that there is no bahya prapancha so they say that there is skanda skanda me are some you know some uh, uh, skandas are five so they are like um, so there is rupa vedana sanya samskara vidyana so these are all uh, uh, categorizations within in the antakarana they categorize uh, uh, for a lack of better word we'll say vrittis what we say as vrittis uh, in uh, uh, in vedanta so we'll call it something like that it is not exactly so but these are called as skanda they are what they are uh, you know inner emotions or some categories in the antakarana now this categories these categories of skandhas in the antakarana cause the appearance outside that is their claim so ubhaya hetu is what prapancha has either parmanu conjoining outside as the hetu or skandhas within as the hetu so whether the ubhaya hetu hetu means what ubhaya hetu is either the parmanus coming together outside samudaya or this kanda within appearing outside and ubhaya hetuka kapratya is in indicating a bahuri so ubhaya hetuke samudaya so samudaya is the anya pada so samudaya is not the hetu samudaya is the end result of the hetu which hetu ubhaya hetu either the parmanus outside or the skanda within so ubhaya ubhaya uh, ubhaya is what we can put together the bahya skanda and uh, bahya parmanu and anta skanda so bahya parmanu anta skanda ubhaya ubhayo hetu 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 ubhayo hetu yasya samudayasya सह समुदाय उभय हेतुक समुदाय उभय हेतुक समुदाय दट इज दि बहुरी देन समुदाय सप्तमी एक वचन तस्वीन समुदाय देर फोर तस्वीन उभय हेतुके समुदाय समुदाय सो वेन यू लुक एट दिस समुदाय दि ग्रुपिंग विच हेज कम टूगेदर एज बाह्य प्रपंच वेदर ड्यू टू 
the paramanus really coming together outside or the skandhas coming together within whether we need not say skandhas coming together we can say adhya we can say skandhas coming together so adhyatmika samudaya so samudaya so whether it is the samudaya outside really due to paramanus or really in the sense uh, meaning compared to the inner the outer is said to be real so uh, instead of that i'll drop the word real whether there is a world outside which has come together due to paramanus being the hetu for the prapancha outside samudaya of the prapancha outside or whether it is this kanda which is adhyatmika which is within within a person within an individual who is seeing the prapancha cognizing the prapancha for that person the adhyatmika skandhas have become hetu for the samudaya outside so ubhay hetu ke api even if you pick one over the other or you pick basically you pick either in either paksha or tarap prapti hi tarap prapti is samudaya prapti so ubhay hetu ke samudaye whichever paramanus outside or the adhyatmika skanda within adhyatmika itself means within so whether the skanda within skandhas within or paramanus outside are considered by you as the hetu for the jagat samudaya outside in either case api samudaya tarap prapti samudaya prapti samudaya itself will not be possible they cannot they won't be able to come together why so that we will see in the vritti in the next part it's a little uh, complex that's why i given a little idea and overview as to what is the bauddha paksha and then we look at how this kandas cannot lead to samudaya outside and how the paramanus also cannot lead to the samudaya outside the refutation of the paramanus being the hetu and forming the prapancha outside by being karana that refutation is similar to what we have done with the uh, vaisheshikas recently in the earlier adhikarana and similar to pradhana is also some similarity is there in pradhana refutation also with the sankhya refutation so we'll see the, that part in the next part ha amna yante samsiddha madhi madhyanta varjita mahananda ghanam apurnam atme jyoti upasmahe tatsat namaste dhanyavada namaste ಶಾಂತಿಂಕರ್ತಾ ಧಾತಾಂಚಾಮಿ